Now we're going to look at total system settings. This is the entire system. There's some parameters in there. If you want to customize, we can set there. So if we open up that tab, go under our settings tab, now we have compressor lockout temperature. If we have a communicating outdoor piece of equipment with an outdoor sensor attached, it will see the outdoor temperature and we can lock the heat pump out by that sensor with that temperature. Now your set point satisfy rate is how this piece of equipment is going to run to satisfy the call for heat or cool. This can be done by just the time only, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30. If we set it to 30, it's going to see the algorithms from its past run cycles and change it for staging so we can run that 30 minutes. So we may keep a longer first stage before we go into high stage or vice versa. If we use a custom setting, now we can change our staging all the way up to 240 minutes before we'll go into high fire or all the way down to one minute if we want to eliminate the staging and go right to high fire. For heat pump applications with dual fuel or fossil fuel gas, we do have some changes or some modification we can do. We have custom stage up percentage, custom stage down percentage, heat pump to gas furnace, and target threshold over or under that's going to look at the cycles each one's going to run before it changes the setting. These do not have to be changed. They can be left at the default. The system will operate just fine.